Nigerian Central Bank Governor and Deputies get 10 billion Naira bulletproof SUVs, housing, over and overseas allowances. And are they here? And are they shall say hunger day? Then they come out on our head. The news in detail, please. Citing insider sources, additionally, the CBA reportedly bought 20 Toyota Camry cars for management and board members worth around 84 million naira. The Central Bank of Nigeria, CBN, has faced criticisms for its recent expenditures amounting to several billions of naira amid the economic challenges in the country. According to reports, the CBN governor, Yemi Kadoso, and his four deputies have acquired armored vehicles and received substantial allowances running into billions of naira. Daily Nigeria reports. The governor allegedly purchased six Amos Lexus LX600 vehicles at a cost of over 10 billion naira, with each deputy governor receiving one vehicle and the governor retaining two for use in Lagos and Abuja, Daily Nigerian further reported. Citing insider sources, additionally, the CBN reported the bought 20 Toyota Camry cars for management and, mo and board members worth around 84 million naira. The sources, according to the report, claimed that the governor and deputies had increased their annual hosting, their annual housing allowances to approximately 1 billion naira despite occupying official residences in Abuja. Furthermore, they have allegedly upgraded their international travel privileges to first class and received a nightly allowance of 7,000 naira, $7,000 for foreign trips and received a nightly allowance of 7,000 naira for foreign trips. Sahara reporters report that Kadoso and the bank deputy governors, namely M.M. Usoro, Philip Ikeazo, Bala Bello and Sani Abdullahi were nominated and confirmed by the Senate in September 2023. The bank spending has raised questions about its priorities during a time of economic hardship in Nigeria, in which an average Nigerian cannot afford two square meals per day. Meanwhile, checks on the price of Lexus LX600 on www.fox7austin.com. The full-size LX600 is based on the latest Toyota Land Cruiser, which is a favorite of government agencies and aid organizations operating in hostile areas. The LX600 is aimed more at the rich and famous looking for protection and includes a host of features that turn their trucks into luxurious bunkers. The vehicle has been fully armored to take shots from 7.62 mm rifle and has been certified to be able to withstand simultaneous blasts from two hand grenades. Along with the ballistic bodywork and glass, the vehicle is equipped with protection for its engine, cargo area, and fuel tank. It rides on a beefed up suspension to handle the extra weight and run flat tires to keep it moving under all circumstances, the website said. Options include a siren fire suppression system, night vision cameras and escape hatches in case it is road or otherwise disabled. According to the experts, the standard LX600 which is 409 HP turbocharged V6 and 4x4 drive train starts at $88.245, while the armored version costs well over $200,000 depending on the configuration. Meanwhile, Sahara reporters' efforts to speak with the spokesperson of the CBN, Hakama Sidi Ali, were unsuccessful as he neither answered his calls nor respond to a text message, both SMS and WhatsApp, as time as at the time of filing this report. <laughs> you will never see anything. Oh, dear boy, your eyes will clear. <laughs> eh, we are talking about how the presidency bought him um, jets. Uh, yes, private jets. Whatever you call it, eh, in this period of hunger, the presidency they carry over 150 million dollars, not naira, to buy jets. That's one I said now because the presidency has taught them by example, they are not coming out to buy cars for themselves. You know, they had the car, one of the cars, not 200,000 dollars. Wait, make I do the mathematics. No, no, so that uh, let me do the mathematics so that you people understand. Let it not be this girl is making noise. Why is she shouting? Let me do it. Let's peg the price for 1,600. Let it not say okay. Make let it not one six. Abi cash no one six times was two hundred thousand. Let me be doing it for people. That is three hundred and twenty million. 
naira and let me tell you people it is even it is even possible that oh my god yeah, price here yeah. yes because anything where they talk for news some of them are lies some of them are you know you the truth you know they tell and finish why me and you we are lavishing eh we did they mash our teeth together they see whether we go fit afford some things school fees don't pull money see school now very soon now school go resume and uh, everything don't pull money both socks which children they wear children's stockings you don't they expensive even children what are they talk school fees the right the price don't triple in the midst of all this suffering these people are lavishing our money <laughs> now some of them are go come outside they talk say it go better for these people for as many as you people are saying that the government is working for as many people are coming to deny the fact that this government they are not working, you will smell your anus. In fact, you will test it. You will, it will happen to you that now you go to lament. You go to lament the person on the crease. You see that in China, they come outside and they talk, say, ah, things no good. Things to get as things be. You come outside, they tell Nigeria and say, no lie. Say, to number get plant. Say, to number go do well. You go experience with it and the experience in 10, what's that they talk? In 100 fold. So that you will, you will use, now you go use them and say, ah, ah, these people, they want to, they want, ah, no, their own is too much. You will experience it. Tell me, people will be saying they put, imagine, oh, and we are paying these people with our money, oh. We are paying these people with our hard end money, our taxes. And then after paying them, they will use our money to buy. I'm even saying, is it this period that we are even supposed to be buying cars? See this period, if in a country gets sense, anything official cars, anything extra allowances, they will scrap it because they need the money for other things. She, they keep complaining that there is no money available. That Buhari has sacked all the place. That in fact, we even the old people. Why are they now spending and lavishing our money? I don't want to share one for it. Did they hit their head on the floor? Eh? Why is this continuous uh, continu uh, what, what is this reoccurring? Why? And some people will come outside with their full chests and they will be supporting this government. <laughs> hey, hey, hey. This is an insensitive government that has no regard for the poor and the their citizens. Now, now you know, we told you guys, I told you that these people. They're up to no good. But she now say no, it's no low war. He's not going to come in and he's not they're looking for your money. What is happening now? Hmm? What kill on Shelly? Okay. Alright, so on this note, we have come to the end of the news. We say thank you for telling in to listen until I come your way next time. Enjoy the rest of your day.